Hi, hello and welcome students to our channel Math Logic. In today's video, we'll be solving a very interesting problem on trigonometry. We'll be using trigonometric identities and we'll be evaluating trigonometric functions within a given range. And uh, let's see the question. Find the number of solutions of the equation sin x plus sin 2x plus sin 3x is equal to 0, where x assumes the value between 0 and 2 pi. Now, in, whenever we try to uh, solve at, uh, equations that involves trigonometric functions, let us always look for any trigonometric identities to simplify the equation. Here we see sin x plus sin 3x can be paired to apply that uh, sum to product rule of uh, identity rather like sum to product identity which says sin a plus sin b is equal to 2 sin a plus b by 2 into cos a minus by, by 2. So let's uh, rewrite the equation as sin x plus sin 3x plus sin 2x and let's say sin x is equal to a and sin 3x is equal to b. By applying that uh, sum to product identity, it reduce, get reduced to 2 sin of x plus 3x by 2 cos x minus 3x by 2 plus sin 2x. And uh, we can write now the equation as 2 sin 2x cos of minus x plus sin 2x. Since uh, cosine is an even function, we can write cos of minus x as cos x. Therefore, the equation now becomes 2 sin 2x cos x plus sin 2x. Since sin 2x is the common factor, let's take it out and write, rewrite the equation as sin 2x into 2 cos x plus 1 is equal to 0. This gives us either sin 2x is equal to 0 or 2 cos x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now, let's first evaluate sin 2x is equal to 0. We know sin 180 degrees or sin pi is equal to 0. Therefore, any integer multiplied by pi will be 0. So, we have sin, for example, let's say n pi is, is equal to 0, since 2x is a sin, 2x is, a, is also equal to 0, and sin n pi is also equal to 0, we can say 2x is equal to n pi or x is equal to n by 2 pi. And now let's apply values of n and see what are the value x assumes when n is 0, x is also 0, when n is 1, x is equal to pi by 2, when n is 2, x is equal to pi, when n is 3, x is equal to 3 by 2 pi. And when n is 4, x is equal to 2 pi and beyond n is equal to 4, x sin 2x is uh, more than 2 pi. Therefore, we stop with this. And now we have 5 solutions for sin 2x is equal to 0, where x assumes values between 0 and 2 pi. And now let's uh, solve uh, the other part of the equation, 2 cos x plus 1 is equal to 0. This gives us cos x is equal to minus 1 by 2. We know cos 60 is equal to 1 by 2 and cos 60 can be written as pi by 3. Therefore, we have we take uh, 60 or pi by 3 as a reference angle. And now let's now have a look at the reference table for positive values of uh, trigonometric function. In quadrant 1, all trigonometric functions are having positive values. In Q2, that is quadrant 2, sine function has uh, positive values. And in quadrant 3, tangent function has uh, positive values. In quadrant 4, cosine function has uh, positive values. Therefore, uh, since we know that cosine function in this case is having negative value, our range is restricted to quadrant 2 and quadrant 3. And in quadrant 2, the reference angle is represented as pi minus theta. Since we have theta is equal to pi by 3, we have pi minus pi by 3, which is equal to 2 pi by 3, which is less than 2 pi. Therefore, it is one solution for this equation. And in quadrant 3, the reference angle is represented as pi plus theta. Since we have theta is equal to pi by 3, we have pi plus pi by 3 is equal to 4 by 3 pi, which is less than 2 pi. So, we have two solutions for 2 cos x plus 1 is equal to 0, where x assumes values between 0 and 2 pi. Therefore, the equation sin x plus sin 2x plus sin 3x is equal to 0 has a total of 7 solutions, whereas x assumes values of 0 and 2 pi, that is values between 0 and 2 pi. So, it's a very, very brilliant question and very interesting question. This question has been posted by one of our students and subscribers. I request all the subscribers and students here, please share your doubts, post the questions. We will be ready to make very quality content videos on this and uh, practice more and more problems and uh, stay tuned till the next video have a nice day students